Hey guys, it's Rick Boogs, CEO of the Boogs Cruise, reporting in with the hottest news of how to get your succulent and stacked. So listen guys, today I uh, I wanted to get I wanted to go heavy. I wanted to do dips, try to build some tries, build them pectorals, uh, just you know, get back on that game train in terms of intensity and things of that sort. But here's the thing, guys, it's almost getting laughable now as to how many golden hot tidbits. I'm just stumbling across. So, I mean, I'm going to have pockets on these shorts, but here, I got a little pocket right here. I'm going to give you this succulent tidbit right now. I'm telling you guys, I guarantee you right now, I'm going to have the chest of Arnold Schwarzenegger. Okay? I'm telling you that right now. I, I, I can bet my bottom dollar that my chest is going to get stacked and jacked right at the top, the top of the pack when it comes to swollenness. And I'm reporting why, it's, it's, this, it's a meme of a machine, the fly. Oh my God, the fly, the fly. That's for gym bros, right? Yeah, I bought this thing shortly after I had surgery, so because I wanted to do something seated that I wasn't gonna, wasn't gonna tweak me up. And uh, I found out shortly that, yeah, the fly, it's kind of a, it's a, it's not a good machine, right? Because the thing is, Depending on where the arms are, right? Like the hardest range of the motion is back. And as soon as you can get through here, this is just peanuts. Peanuts, even more so with dumbbells, right? <clears throat> peanuts. So I'm gonna show you guys something I just started doing today, and I'm, I swear, I swear that this is giving me the best chest pump. All right, I looked in the mirror and I thought I was 40 pounds heavier after I hit this mechanical drop set. Insane, guys. So, let me just set, let me just show you what I got going on here and how we do this. All right, I got a Lion King towel because I'm feeling like the king of the jungle right now hitting this exercise. So that explains that. Down here, I have four different bands. Two black bands, red band, and an orange band. Again, if you guys haven't bought these mini bands, like you have to buy these because not only the shoulder mobility stuff, but just so many other things that you can do to get that sick, juicy pump, like the triceps, for example. And then I just have another plate here. Uh, when I did the main drop set, mechanical drop set, I had uh, 325s on each side. But I'm not going to, you know, I already worked out for like two hours now, so I'm just going to demo this. Uh, I have the seat as low as it can go so that the uh, biomechanics of the movement is as hard as possible at the beginning. And then as you can see here, you can move this pin. All right, and the farther back, because this is all lever, like if it's on the third notch and I pull it, all right, the bands are gonna get more resistance earlier on than when I, if I move the lever to the closest notch, right? Because now when I initiate the pull, the arms are already more forward, so there's no tension here. You understand what I'm saying? So if the arm is further back, I'm gonna get more resistance out of the bands. Do you understand what I'm saying? So I'm gonna start on the fourth notch and then I can just, to uh, decrease the band tension, every time I burn out, I'm just gonna bring the arm closer and closer and closer. So let me show you guys how this is just so sick. And uh, if you don't have this at a home gym, I mean a lot of you guys don't have home gyms anyways, and I'm sorry you're out of luck, but a lot of you guys do work out at gyms and just bring your mini bands and you can hook this up to the fly machine. Every fly machine or every gym has a fly machine. I'm telling you, there's, I've never had a chest pump like this before and I'm gonna, I'm gonna do this a lot and I swear, I swear on all that is boobs that this is gonna blow up my chest. So let me show you, let me demo this. <laughs> we got four different ways that we're changing the mechanics of it. So first and foremost, I'm on, I'm pretty far back here, so a really big stretch. Uh, is that right? Let me see. Three, ah, let it check. Okay, so first things first, I'm gonna start high. High handle, really bad. Bad mechanics. You gotta explode, control down. Cause it's a band, explode through it. safe putting it down because there's four mini bands that aren't loaded when I put it down. So it's safe for my shoulder. 
And I'm changing it to the low handle. For better mechanics, we're gonna fry. Jeez. Wow. Okay. And then we can move this about two notches forwards so there's less band tension. You guys understand that? And we can go back high. Oh my god. Man. Not gonna get a ton of reps with everyone. Okay, so as you can see, I gotta drop the weight now. So take a 20, take a 25 off each side. And we can go back to about the third notch. Let's go high. Jeez. See. Oh my god. Let's go low. Come on. Come on, Rick. Oh, just absolutely fried. Well, let's go to the closest one because I'm not getting much, I'm not getting any reps here. And we'll stay low. There we go. Less bad tension. Distances. This is just, I swear to you guys. Oh, look at that. Wow. I'm Ricky B. I hope you enjoyed that tidbit.